The South Carolina Gamecocks win their sixth consecutive ball game, taking down Utah Valley 10 to three to sweep the series this weekend here in Columbia. Hello everybody. I am Birch Antley along with Kip Bolt Knight as we recap this game for you here at Founders Park. A lot of home run balls for South Carolina and a lot of first pitch strikes for Gamecock starter Reed Morgan who gets the win. Yeah, Reed Morgan was outstanding from the very first pitch of the game, Birch. You know, just tons of first pitch strikes and throwing a lot of pitches. His fastball is sinking back over the middle, and or not over the middle, rather, but just over the outside corner slider, throwing it for strikes. Just outstanding job. And five home runs from the Gamecock offense, including two from Chris Cullen. Just outstanding work from the Gamecocks as a whole. Well, let's take a look back at the highlights, and we will start with Gamecock starter Reed Morgan. Nine strikeouts today, no walks. He is yet to walk a batter all season long. It is outstanding, Birch. Again, from pitch one, as you see the slider there, a good fastball running back on the outside corner, two in a row there, and he, he just made his strikes look like balls and his balls look like strikes. He was outstanding today. Two more than quality starts in a row for him. And South Carolina with a power hitting. It starts with Chris Cullen, who hits three home runs in two days, a couple today, and then Brady Allen with a solo home run, followed Noah Campbell's solo shot, and then Eister with his first home run of the season, and that was probably the longest ball that we have seen all year that was hit here at Founders Park. With the win, it is Reed Morgan, his first of the season. South Carolina gets the series sweep over Utah Valley as they win today on Sunday, 10-3. In Columbia, for Kip Knight, I am Birch and Lee.